vessels contain a mixture of spirit and water. So there are two mixtures of spirit and water. In the first vessel, the ratio of spirit to water is 8 is 3. And in the second vessel, the ratio is 5 is to 1. Now there is a 35 liter container which is filled from these two vessels. So as to contain a mixture of spirit and water in the ratio of 4 is to 1. How many liters are taken out from the first vessel? Now very simple. Uh, you know, first ratio is 8 is 3. Second ratio is 5 is to 1. The mixture of these two ratios will give you a ratio of 4 is to 1. Right? All these ratios are what? Spirit to water. You see? Spirit to water. Here also it is spirit to water. The final mixture is also spirit is to water. Now you either take the concentrations of spirit in all the three cases or the concentration of water in all the three cases and try to apply the allegation rule. As simple as that. You getting it? For example, it's, let's go by the concentration of spirit. What is the concentration of spirit in the first one? See it is 8 is to 3. Right? So I can say 8 out of 11 parts. 8 parts out of 8 plus 3, 11 parts. In the second one, the ratio is 5 is to 1. So what's the concentration of spirit? 5 parts out of 5 plus 1, 6 parts. In the overall mixture, the ratio is 4 is to 1. So what will be the concentration of spirit? 4 parts out of 4 plus 1, 5 parts. Apply allegation rule to this. You will get a ratio. Divide 35 liters. See the overall mixture quantity was 35 liters. So divide 35 liters in the ratio that you get here. Right? That, that will give you the final answer. You getting it? So it will be like 5 by 6 minus 4 by 5 which comes here and this will be 4 by 5 minus 8 by 11 that comes here. That's the ratio. Divide 35 liters in this ratio. Okay. There is a smarter way of solving the question. The smart way of solving the question is that you know that the cons uh, the quantity of the, he is asking us to find out what? How many liters are taken out from the first vessel? We know that the ratio in the first vessel is 8 is to 3. So the answer should be a multiple of 11. But here there are multiple options, is there a multiple of 11. See the ratio of spirit to water in the first container is 8 is to 3. 8 parts and 3 parts, 11 parts. So whatever is the quantity taken, there has to be some multiple of 11. Unfortunately, 22 is a multiple of 11, 11 is a multiple of 11, 16.5 is also a multiple of 11, 1.5 into 11 is 16.5, 17.5 can be eliminated if I go by the technique. But since there are three options left out, we'll anyway have to do the complete solution, right? So let's do that. What comes here? Uh, 30 is LCM, right? So 30 is LCM, 5 into 5, 25 and 4 into 6, 24, 1 by 30, right? Here 55 is the LCM. So... 11 times right 44 and 5 times gives you 40 44 minus 40 is 4 so the final answer is going to be what 55 is to 120 or nothing but 11 is to 24 that's it if you have to divide 35 liters see total quantity is 35 liters if you divide 35 liters in the ratio of uh, uh, 11 is to uh, 24 the first one will be 11 liters and second one is going to be 24 liters Straight, right? 1124 itself is 35. So the first quantity was 11 liters. The quantity taken from the first container was 11 liters. The quantity taken from the second container should be uh, should be 24 liters. So simple solution. I mean, there's nothing complex about it. It's just that instead of percentages, we usually use percentages. In these three places, we use percentages, percentage concentrations. Here, ratios have been given, so you are using fractions. But fractions are percentages, the method remains the same.